It's a somewhat sunny day in Los Angeles right now, uh, but we're out and about today and we're taking another look at the Honor 9X. Now this phone is becoming more available in more markets, so if you've been waiting for a chance to get your hands on this pretty affordable device, well, now's your chance. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of the cameras and some of the features in this video, uh, so follow along with me. It's a day out in LA. Lovely designed phone associated with this X design on the back, and of course, the pop up camera. Which makes it so that you don't have to worry about anything getting into the screen. Uh, just a way to start off the day, or rather to start off this video even. Uh, the front-facing camera is actually pretty wide, it's not too bad, and especially since it's a pop-up, that's nice to see. But I am going to get a little bit more distance from it for future shots, just by using this little tabletop tripod as a bit of a selfie stick. So let's pop that on. We'll see how the audio fares. Also, let me expand this up a bit more to get some better framing. But as far as the audio is concerned, there are some fountains right behind me, so let's see how that fares. But yeah, something like this definitely helps for the front-facing camera, especially if you're gonna be vlogging a little bit. That's exactly what I'm doing today, after all. Uh, but let's talk a little bit about the performance of the phone. Uh, after all, while I'm using the camera and messing around with the phone, I'm still doing some stuff like playing games and messaging and getting on Instagram, for example. While we were in there, Issa was filming a few things, and I just was playing Mario Kart Tour on the phone. And the Kirin 710F is doing a great job in this phone, so the performance is still at a good clip, even though the phone is really affordable. Off to another part of the area. Let me just bring down the exposure a bit. The front-facing camera in particular does come in a little bit hot. You gotta lower the exposure, that'll help things out a little bit. But take a look at this. Great background for just photos and videos in general. It's a good spot. All right, so as far as the triple cameras on the back are concerned, you're probably going to end up seeing a majority photos from the 48 megapixel main sensor. The only reason why is because the 8 megapixel wide angle is like super wide. There's actually distortion on the sides in both photos and videos. There's your wide angle there. It's nice to have wide angle for video, obviously, and I'm just trying to record a good looking video, especially under daylight, so things should look pretty good, but you can probably see it over on the sides. It's not, it's not the worst thing, but it is something to consider with the 8 megapixel wide. Uh, but yeah, it's 8 megapixels, and then you also have a 2 megapixel depth sensor, which does help for portraits and whatnot, but 48 megapixels is where it's at. Claremont Packing House. Beautiful spot. Uh, in here it's actually more low light so it's definitely like an indoor situation. I'm actually walking up to this Christmas tree right now to make sure I have some decent lighting <laughs> as you can see. Uh, but I went ahead and did a night shot mode here and it absolutely helps in these situations. I'll get even more later as we go out for dinner. But yeah, take a look at this. The night shot is definitely way better than the ones I got just in the auto mode. So I mentioned earlier that the camera, especially the front-facing camera, does come in pretty hot. So you have to make sure to bring down the exposure, but you can lock the exposure and the focus pretty easily by tapping and holding. So I've definitely been doing that a lot during this video. Uh, there were a couple of fun things that I realized about taking selfies with this phone though. Uh, you have the hand gesture, which is fairly common, but it's a nice feature to have. And then when you turn on the flash, the entire screen gets really bright, except for the little window in the middle where hopefully your face is. Uh, so yeah, it, you can see the difference in this clip right now. Shouts 
shouts out to the girlfriend, Issa Rodriguez, for getting this shot. Uh, but yeah, it does get plenty bright, so that's, that's pretty cool. So you can get some pretty nice selfies, even in low light situations. is crazy right now. A lot of people ahead of us. Very possible we won't be eating at this particular spot, but the food that's here is what we're looking for, so stand by on the vlog. All right, well, we found it. Uh, a place that we could come to and have that delicious dog bucky. Uh, that was a day out in LA with the Honor 9X. This is the kind of stuff that you can get off of these cameras. And again, remember that uh, despite a couple of things about the cameras you have to keep in mind, you're still getting all of that on a phone that is really affordable. So if you want to see more about the Honor 9X, I have done a couple of other videos here on Pocket Now for them. So uh, why don't you go ahead and check those out as well as I get into the outro. All right, and that was a look at the Honor 9X on this day out in LA. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I showed you what you can get out of the cameras of this super affordable phone that is becoming available in more markets, which is exciting. If you notice, I didn't have a whole lot of pictures of the food that we ate at the end uh, because we were so hungry after the long day of vlogging and then we had the subsequent food coma. So I hope you can bear with me with that, but also here are some final shots of the device itself along with some photos and videos from it. Now, if you have an Honor 9X, let us know what your experience has been like. Uh, it is a super affordable phone that just happens to have the performance you might need for daily usage. And as you saw from the cameras, you can get some good footage and photos out of it. In any case, I'm going to call it on this one. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to Pocket Now if you haven't already. Hit that bell on the side so you can keep up with everything that we're doing. And then drop some likes on this video. And again, get into the discussions in the comment sections down below. With all of that, we're going to go ahead and call it on this one. And we will see you in our next video.